So you decided to give the mascara a try. Now what? Well, I'm gonna go over a few things with you to make the transition between your old mascara to this new mascara just a little bit easier, because it is a little different. So to start out with, um, it's gonna come in this little kit right here. And when you open it up, um, you pull it out and there's a little flap you can lift up that has the three step directions on it. Um, but I'm just gonna go over the best way that I have found um, to put on the mascara and get the best results. So your mascara comes in this little bag, and I think it's great because I can throw in um, an eyeliner or a lip gloss um, in there with my mascara and throw it in my purse and I'm good to go. So first thing I'm going to show you is the two tubes. You've got the longer tube here, which is your gel, and your shorter tube, which is your fibers. So one thing I want you to remember, repeat it to yourself as many times as you need to, gel, fibers, gel. If you remember those three steps, you're good to go. So first I'm going to do is take my gel, okay, and apply it just like you would your regular mascara. You don't need a thick coat, um, just a, a real thin light coat's perfect. Then you're going to take your gel, take it on the back of your hand right here, and just roll it. That's going to compact the fibers so you're not going to get big clumps anywhere. And then you're going to put this on mid to upper tip or mid to tip of your lash. You don't want to go all the way to the waterline. I'm just going to pull that off. Okay, now this is where I do things a little bit different. Once I've put the fibers on, I move over to my other eye and do the gel and fibers again. Sorry, you'll have to look up my nose. <laughs> it's not my best angle. <laughs> now the fiber is gonna roll it on the back of my hand and again, just mid to tip. Okay. Now, the reason I do this um, is I found that giving it a minute between the fibers and the last gel coat gives those fibers a chance to kind of cling to that first gel coat. And then you're not going to get any of the fibers falling on your face or anything like that. So now I'm going to go back and do my gel on the first eye. Okay. Now, if you, I usually just do one coat during the day, but if you want to do a second coat, this is when you want to do it on this eye. Don't move it over to this eye and then try to come back and do your second layer. Um, it's not it's not going to look as good because the fibers aren't going to hold as well. So I'll do a quick second layer on this eye just so y'all can see. So I take the gels again, just do it kind of on the tip. Fibers. And again, the gel. All right, so now I've done two coats on this eye. Sorry, it's kind of hard to put mascara on and uh, <laughs> cell phone camera. But I wanted to get the point across. So now I'm going to move over to this eye and do my final gel stage. All right, and you're good to go. Now, I only put the gel on my bottom lashes. I do not put the fibers. Um, I just think it gets it too close to my eyes. But if you want to give that a shot, you are more than welcome to. You'll just make sure you do the gel fiber gel um, on, the, on the bottom as well. And there you have it. 
just remember gel fiber gel and you will do great please let me know if you have any questions or if you have any problems with your mascara definitely give me um, a shout I'm deaf I'm here to help okay